Hello everyone, how are you? Now in this video we're going to draw some cartoon arms so as always we're going to go very simple, break everything into simple shapes. Let's do this. Now first thing I want to mention is I do have here a bit of a reference so we can look at and know where everything is going to be with our arms. So as you can see these red circles on the background, so we are using the head as a measurement. I duplicate them multiple times and let's see where our arms are. So we start with the shoulder right here, right? And then it goes all the way down to here. So basically we have here two and more or less half heads for the arm. So that's what we're going to be using to start our arm. This is going to be our guideline. So I'm going to go over here, I'm going to draw one circle. It doesn't need to be a perfect circle, this is just a sketch, a guideline. Then I'm going to duplicate it once and then twice. Now I'm going to create here some guidelines. So we have one at the bottom, so where our arm ends, we're going only to draw an arm, so we're not going to draw hands here. Now another one here, another one here. Just like we saw here that the shoulder starts roughly a little bit higher than middle of the, the circle here. So let's grab here one of our other guidelines and let's leave it around here. I think this is good. So we have our guidelines here. We have everything we need to draw our arm. Now, one thing, the size of the circle that you use, or so the size of the head isn't really important. What's important is that you maintain that same size for all the body, in this case, just for the arm. So I'm going to add some transparency here. And now I'm going to draw some shapes for the arm. As you can see here, we only have like some lines and some, cir some circles in our reference here and we want to make something a little bit more substantial, right? So we're going to start here a circle for the shoulder area, something like this. Then we have a shape, rectangular shape basically going down. So we have here half of our arm, we have shoulder, part of the arm and now the other side we can add here a circle if you want an extra shape and now here we go down straight line and here we have a little bit of a curve and then we go down as well so these are the kind of shapes i like to use when drawing arms of course as you go you might uh, skip some shapes for example i usually just use these two and I'm done but while you're learning don't be afraid to use as many shapes and guidelines as you need if they are helping you then do as much as you want and then as you get used to it you can start skipping uh, some shapes there it's totally fine you'll see that as you learn things as uh, your body starts to memorize the shapes you won't need as many guidelines now I duplicated here my shapes, now it's time to draw a very quick sketch, so a very quick detailed sketch, the arms don't have a whole lot of detail, but again it's good to not skip this step if you're just starting, If you, the more practice you get the best, so try to do as many sketch as you want before going for a final version of your drawing. So. We go here, round for the shoulder, then down, then a little bit out again, a little bit of a curve, then down again. Now here we have this line that curves, but then you have the torso here usually, right? This is more or less what we have. So we go down, here we have a straight line all the way down and then we close this shape again. We can add here a line where the, the arm bends right, it's totally fine. Just add a little bit more detail. And now we can do our final lines. So I'm just going to copy this one here, bring it to the side, and now we just draw some final lines. So 
for the final lines we just go over all the lines we've done so far it's very simple again you can even skip the sketch phase i recommend doing it just because it's some extra practice but once you got your shapes you can just go and draw your final lines right away you have here a very simple way of drawing arms in your character without a lot of fuss very simple and you can even simplify this even more it's totally up to your own art style some people will just draw a rectangle for the arms and that's it this all depends on the style we have the style we want to go for but this is how i usually go when drawing arms so this is it for this video if you want to learn more i do have a video on how to draw a whole carton body so check that out and as always keep on drawing